Unit one. A. An. Noun. A boy. An apple. A cat. An egg. A school. An owl. Grammar tips. Tips for a, uh, an. A uh is used with words that begin with a consonant. N is used with words that begin with a vowel, such as A, E, I, O, U. Tips for nouns. Nouns are names of things, people, animals, and places. A and an are both used for singular nouns. One noun. Examples Let's look at some examples of nouns. Under people, we have a boy, a girl, a friend, a mom. Under things, we have an apple, a book, an eraser, an umbrella. Under animals, a dog, an elephant, a lion, a mouse. And under places, a house, a school, a church, a hospital. Right and wrong. Now let's look at the right and wrong section. The first one says, and teacher. This is wrong because teacher begins with a consonant. So we need a. Teacher is part of the people section. A teacher. Next is a octopus. This is wrong because octopus begins with a vowel. Octopus is from the animal section. An octopus. Next is an playground. This is wrong because playground begins with a consonant. We use a. Playground is a place. A playground. And last is an car. We use a with car because it begins with a consonant. A car is a thing. Quiz Circle the right 
word. A N pencil. Pencil begins with a consonant. So we circle a. A pencil. And book. Book begins with a consonant. So we circle a. A pencil and a book. A and apple. Apple begins with a vowel. So we circle N. N apple. Banana begins with a consonant. So we circle A. A banana. An apple and a banana. A and ham. Ham begins with a consonant. So we circle a. A ham. Egg begins with a vowel. So we circle n. An egg. A ham and an egg. Quiz. Circle the correct expression. A. A strawberry. B. An strawberry. Strawberry begins with a consonant. So we circle A. A strawberry. A, a umbrella. B, an umbrella. Umbrella begins with a vowel. We use N with vowels. So we circle B, an umbrella. A. A boy. B. N boy. Boy begins with a consonant. We use a with consonants. So circle A. A boy. A. A frog. B. And frog. Frog begins with F, a consonant. So you circle A, a frog. Find the mistake. And correct it. And bird. Bird begins with a consonant B. So we say a bird. Write a bird on the line. And flower. Flower begins with a consonant. We do not use N with consonants. So you write a flower on the line. And coat. Coat begins with a consonant. We use a with consonants. 
You write a coat on the line. A island. Island begins with a vowel. We use N with vowels. So you write an island on the line. A uncle. Uncle begins with U. It's a vowel. So you write an uncle on the line. And crayon. Crayon begins with C, a consonant. And we use a with consonants. So you write a crayon on the line. Unit 2. Plurals. A book. Two books. An apple. Two apples. A child. Four children. A potato. Six potatoes. A glass. Three glasses. A man. Three men. Grammar tips. We will look at some tips for what you just listened to. Tips for plurals. We use plurals to say more than one thing, person, animal, and place. To make singular nouns into plurals, we put s, es, ies on the end of the noun. We don't use a and n with plural nouns. They are only for Singular nouns. Examples. Now let's take a look at some examples. First, we have noun plus s. Dog. Dog is one noun. To make it plural, we use s. Dogs. Next is book. Book is one. To make it more than one, you add s. Books. Next, we have a noun that has the ending of s, ch, x, ss, sh, or o. With these endings, we put es to make it 
plural. First is bus. Bus ends with s. So you add es. Buses. Glass. Glass ends with ss. So you add es to make glasses. Church. Church ends with ch. You add es to make churches. Box ends with x. Add es to make boxes. Tomato ends with O. Add ES to make tomatoes. Next, we have a noun, consonant plus Y, plus IES. The, if it ends with Y, and there is a consonant before the Y, you add IES. Baby. Baby ends with Y. There is a consonant B before it. So you take away the Y and add IES. Babies. Next is lady. Take off the Y and add IES to make ladies. Now we have noun. With an F sound, you add V-E-S. Leaf. Leaf ends with an F sound. So you add V-E-S to make leaves. Wolf. It has the F sound. Take off the F and add V E S. Wolves. Right and wrong. Now let's look at the right and wrong section. First, we have bags with ES. This is wrong because bag is a noun that you just add S. Bags. Next is Brushes. This is wrong because the ending is sh. For sh, you have to add es. Brushes. Next, we have heroes. This is wrong because heroes ends with an O. You have to add ES. Heroes. The next one is boys. This is wrong because there is no consonant before Y. 
so you only add s. Boys. And last is life's. This is wrong because life ends with the F sound. So you take away the F and add V E S. Lives. Grammar tips. We have irregular plurals. Some nouns don't follow the same rules as plurals. They change in a different way. Some of them do not change at all. They stay the same. Examples. Now let's look at some examples of singular and plural nouns. The first one is tooth. Tooth is singular. The plural is teeth. The next one is foot. Foot is singular, and the plural form is feet. Next, we have mouse. One mouse, two mice. The next one is child. Child is singular. The plural form is children. The next one is ox. One ox, two oxen. Now we have sheep. Sheep does not change form. One sheep, two sheep. Deer is the same. One deer, two deer. And the last one is fish. This stays the same as well. One fish, two fish. Quiz. Circle the right word. A and apple. Apple is one. It begins with a vowel. We pick an, an apple. Two box, boxes. Two is more than one. We add es. Circle, boxes. An apple. And two boxes. Three mouses, mice. Mouse is an irregular plural noun. It changes to mice. So you circle mice. Three mice. Four toys. You circle T O Y S. It ends with Y, but the letter before it is a vowel. 
You only add s. Three mice and four toys. Five childs, children. Child is an irregular noun. You circle children, five children, and two mom moms. Two is more than one. You add s. Five children. And two moms. Quiz. We will circle the correct expression. A. A glass. B. A glasses. A means it is one. A glass. You circle A. Glass is one. Seven leaves. Seven leaves. Leaf ends with the f sound. So we add. V E S. Seven leaves. You circle B. A two tooths. B two teeth. When you change tooth to plural, you make it into teeth. The plural form of tooth is teeth. So you circle B. Two teeth. A. Three watches. B. Three watches. Watch ends with C H. When you have C H, you add E S to make it plural. So you circle B. Three watches. We will find the mistake and correct it. Two sheep's. Sheep is an irregular plural noun. It does not change. So you write two sheep. Three deers. Deer is also an irregular plural noun. So you write three deer. Three tree. Three is more than one. So we have to add. S to the word tree. The answer is three trees. Two man. Man is an irregular plural noun. We change it to men. The answer is. Two men. Three toys. Toy ends with Y. 
O is a vowel, so we only add S. Three toys, T O Y S. Six tomatoes. Tomato ends with O. So we add ES. Six tomatoes. Unit 3. Pronouns. Be verbs. I am Jake. I am a boy. I am Amy. I am a girl. He is a doctor. She is a nurse. They are a couple. Is it an album? Yes, it is. We are students. Are they teachers? Grammar tips. We will look at some tips for what you just listened to. Tips for pronouns and be verbs. Be verbs are used with different pronouns. The pronoun I is used with the be verb am. I am equals I'm. You is used with the be verb are. You are equals your. The pronoun he is used with is. He is equals he's. She is used with the be verb is. She is equals she's. The pronoun it is used with is. It is equals its. The pronoun we is used with the be verb are. We are equals we're. The pronoun they is used with are. They are equals their. Examples Now let's take a look at some examples. I am a girl is the same as I'm a girl. You are a student is the same as you're a student. He is a teacher is the same as he's a teacher. She is a doctor is the same as she's a doctor. It is a computer is the same as it's a computer. We are friends is the same as we're friends. They are tigers is the same as they're tigers.
right and wrong. Now let's look at the right and wrong section. The first one says, I is a father. This is wrong because the pronoun I is used with am. I am a father. You am a mother is wrong because you is used with are. You are a mother. He are a brother. This is wrong because the pronoun he is used with is. He is a brother. Grammar Tips We have tips for be verbs negative form. The word not is put after the be verbs. This makes it negative. I am not equals I'm not. You are not equals you're not. He is not equals he's not. She is not equals she's not. It is not equals it's not. We are not equals we're not. They are not equals they're not. You can see not is put after all the be verbs. Examples Let's take a look at some examples. I'm not a girl. You're not a student. He's not a teacher. She's not a doctor. It's not a computer. We're not friends. They're not tigers. Right and wrong. Now let's do the right and wrong section. The first one says, You not a kid. This is wrong because the pronoun you comes with the be verb are. You are not a kid. The next one says, He not is a baby. This is wrong because not comes after the be verb. He isn't a baby. They're not a snake. This is wrong because there is the plural form. Snake is a singular form. They're snakes.
Grammar tips. We have tips for be verbs question form. A be verb is put in front of a pronoun to make a question. Am I? Are you? Is he? Is she? Is it? Are we? Are they? Examples Let's look at some examples. Am I a girl? Yes, you are. Are you a student? Yes, I am. Is he a teacher? Yes, he is. Is she a doctor? Yes, she is. Is it a computer? Yes, it is. Are we friends? Yes, we are. Are they tigers? Yes, they are. Right and wrong. Now let's look at the right and wrong section. Are you doctor? This is wrong because you need to put a after the pronoun. Are you a doctor? The next one says, Are he a baby? This is wrong because the pronoun he goes with the be verb is. Is he a baby? The next one, is she nurse? This is wrong because you need a after the pronoun she. Is she a nurse? Is they nurses? This is wrong because the pronoun they comes with the be verb are. Are they nurses? Quiz We will circle the right word. I am, is, are a student. The pronoun I goes with the be verb am. I am a student. He, am, is, are a doctor. He goes with the be verb is. He is a doctor. She am is are not a doctor. She goes with the be verb is. She is not a doctor. Quiz We will circle the correct sentence. A. Are they lions? B. 
Is they lions? The answer is A. Because the B verb are goes with the pronoun they. Are they lions? A. No, it am not. It am a pencil. B. No, it isn't. It is a pencil. The answer is B. Because the pronoun it goes with the B verb is. So you circle B. A. Yes, he are. He are a doctor. B. Yes, he is. He is a doctor. The answer is B. The pronoun he goes with the B verb is. A. No, she isn't. She is a doctor. B. No, she aren't. She are a doctor. The answer is A. She goes with the B verb is. Make a sentence. We will make a sentence using the words. For example, she, teacher, becomes, she is a teacher. He, police officer, becomes, is he a police officer? Look at the ending mark to know if it's a question or a statement. We, friends. It ends with a period. The sentence becomes, we are friends. It ends with a period. The words they, not, Chinese becomes they are not Chinese. You, American. It ends with a question mark. The sentence is, are you American? I, not, Doctor. It ends with a period. The sentence is, I'm not a doctor. It, tiger. It ends with a period. The sentence is, It is a tiger. It, doll. It ends with a question mark. The sentence is, Is it a doll? We will make a sentence using the words below. The first letter should be a capital letter. The first one is Tom is a boy. It ends with a period. The sentence is Tom is a boy. The next one Emily, a girl, is it ends with a period. The sentence is, 
Emily is a girl. The next one. You are a boy. It ends with a question mark. The sentence is, Are you a boy? Be sure to put a capital letter for R. Yes, I am. Are friends we? It ends with a period. The sentence is, We are friends. Be sure to put a capital W at the beginning. Unit 4. What, this, that. What is this? This is a chair. What is that? That's a clock. What are these? They are bananas. What are those? They're grapes. Grammar Tips We'll talk about tips for what you just listened to. Tips for this, that, these, those. This is used to talk about something that is nearby. These is the plural of this. That is used to talk about something that is far away. Those is the plural of that. We use this, that, plus is. These, those, plus are. Examples Let's take a look at some examples. This is a vase and that is a wall. The vase is nearby. This is. The wall is far away. That is. Is this a desk? Yes, it is. These are bags and those are sweaters. The bags are nearby. These. The sweaters are far away. Those. Are those chairs? Yes, they are. Right and wrong. Now let's look at the right and wrong section. The first one says, These is hats. These is plural. We use are with these. These are hats. The next one. This is books. Books is plural. We use these are with plural. These are books. 
Are this a taxi? This is one. We use is with the word this. Is this a taxi? Grammar tips. Let's take a look at tips for using what. When we want to ask about animals or things, we use the word what. What comes before be verbs? When someone asks the question what is, we start the answer by using its. When someone asks a question using what are, we start the answer using their. Examples Now let's take a look at some examples. What is this? It's a cup. The sentence starts with it's. What is that? It's an umbrella. When you ask the question what is, the answer starts with it's. What are these? They are trees. What are is the question. They are starts the answer. What are those? They are buses. Right and wrong. Now let's look at the right and wrong section. What is these? These is plural. So we use are with these. What are these? The next one. What these? When we use the word what, we need a be verb. These is plural, so we use the be verb are. What are these? Ask and answer. Ask and answer. What's this? Apple. It's an apple. What's that? We're talking about a school. The answer is, it's a school. That is talking about one thing. So we use it's. What are those? Here we are using desks. The answer is, their desks. Those means more than one. So we use they are. Quiz. Circle the right word. Look at the arrow for the answer. This, that is a car. The arrow points to far away. We use that when talking about something far away. The answer is that 
is a car. These, those are cameras. The arrow shows nearby. We use these when talking about things nearby. These are cameras. What is this, that? The arrow shows something far away. We use that when talking about something far away. What is that? These, those are not rabbits. The arrow shows nearby. These talks about things nearby. These are not rabbits. What is this, that? The arrow shows something nearby. What is this? What are these, those? The arrow shows things nearby. These talks about things nearby. What are these? Quiz In the next part, we will change the singular sentence to plural. For example, this box is empty. It becomes, these boxes are empty. That pencil is new. The plural of that is those. Pencil becomes pencils. Is becomes are. The sentence is, those pencils are new. For the next part, we will find the mistake and correct it. This is a spoons. This is wrong. For spoons, take off the S because this means singular. The answer could be, this is a spoon. What are this? I will change it to singular. So I will change the R. My sentence is, what is this? Those are a potatoes. Those means plural. Potatoes is plural. So we do not use a. My sentence will be, those are potatoes. These is not a cup. These means plural. Is not a cup is singular. I will change the sentence to This is not a cup. Make a sentence using the words below. The first letter should be a capital. I, Sam, am. 
The sentence should be, I am Sam. Is a dog this? The sentence should be, This is a dog. Puppies, these are. The sentence is, These are puppies. What that is. It's a question. What is that? It is a cat. It should be, it is a cat. Are kittens those? The sentence is, those are kittens. Unit 5. Who, where, prepositions of place, the. Who is she? She is Laura. Where is Alice? She is under the tent. Where is Brian? He is in front of the tree. Where is the computer? It is on the desk. Where are the puppies? They are on the mat in the doghouse. Where is the rabbit? It is behind the tree. Who is the boy next to Susan? He is Alex. Grammar Tips We will look at tips for what you just listened to. Tips for who We used who to ask about a person. The word who comes before be verbs. Examples Let's look at some examples. Who are you? I am Susan. Susan is the answer to the question, who are you? Who is he? He is a policeman. Who is she? She is a teacher. Who are they? They are cooks. Right and wrong. Now let's look at the right and wrong section. What are you? This is wrong because what asks about things? Who asks about people? Who are you? Who is they? This is wrong because they is plural. We need to use are with they. Who are they? Grammar tips. 
we're doing tips for where, prepositions of place. We use where when asking about a place. Where comes before be verbs. The preposition of a place is used to show where things and people are. Examples Let's look at some examples of prepositions. In Where is the pencil? It is in the pencil case. On Where is the plate? It is on the table. Under Where is the bee? The bee is under the flower. Behind Where is the bear? It is behind the tree. Between Who is she? She is Emily. She is between Steve and Jane. Next to Who is he? He is Tom. He is next to Emily. Grammar tips We have tips for using the. We use the for a noun that is already said or it's known among the speakers. Examples Let's look at some examples. It is a rose. The rose is in the garden. We use the for rose because we already talked about the rose. Next, it is a rose. A rose is in the garden. Here we are talking about two different roses. So we use a rose in the second sentence. It is a rose. A rose is in the garden. If you're talking about the same rose, this sentence is wrong. You use the rose if talking about the same rose. This is a puppy. The puppy is in the park. We already know about the puppy. So we say the puppy. This is a puppy. A puppy is in the park. Here we are talking about two different puppies. This is a puppy. A puppy is in the park. If this is the same puppy, then these sentences are wrong. We already know about the puppy, so we should say the puppy is in the park. Quiz 
We will circle the right word. Where, who, is she? She is Emily. Here we are asking about a person. So we use who. Who is she? Where, who, is the boy? He is between next to Emily. Here we are talking about the place of the boy. So we use where. Where is the boy? He is next to Emily. The doll is in, on, under the bed. You can see in the picture, the doll is on the bed. Where is the girl? She is between, in front of, behind the dolls. In the picture, you see the girl is between the dolls. Quiz. We will fill in the blanks. Blank is he. He is Jake. We are talking about a person, so we use who. Who is he? He is Jake. Where is she? She is blank the chair. In the picture, you can see she is behind the chair. Where is Anna? Anna is blank the car. In the picture, you can see Anna is next to the car. We will write a question. The answer is, it is under the chair. Under the chair tells where something is. And we are talking about the cat. The question is, where is the cat? The answer is, he is a firefighter. We are asking about a person. So we use who. The question is, who is he? We will find the mistake and correct it. Where is the plate? It is under the table. You can see the plate is not under the table. It is on the table. Where is the man? He is in front of the tree. In the picture, you see the man is not in front of the tree. He is behind the tree. Who is the woman? She is in the boat. 
The answer talks about where the woman is. So the question is, where is the woman? Who is the boy? He is on the playground. On the playground tells where the boy is, not who he is. The question should be, where is the boy? We will make a sentence using the words below. The first letter should be a capital. Is she Anna? The sentence is She is Anna. Is in the bedroom she? The sentence should be she is in the bedroom. On the chair, the doll is. The doll is on the chair. Is the cat under the chair? The cat is under the chair. Is where the flower? Where is the flower? Is the flower between two books? The flower is between two books. Unit 6. There is, there are. There is an eraser in the pencil case. There are spoons on the plate. Is there a hospital on this map? No, there isn't. Are there cars in the street? Yes, there are. Grammar Tips We will do tips for what you just listened to. Tips for there is and there are. We use there is for singular nouns. We use there are for plural nouns. The short form of there is is theirs. There is no short form for there are. Examples Let's take a look at some examples. There is a subway. We say there is because there's one subway. There's a rose in the garden. There is means there's one rose. There are balls in the store. There's more than one ball. 
You say, there are. There are people in the store. Right and wrong. Now let's look at the right and wrong section. There is notebooks on the desk. Notebooks is plural. You say there are, not there is. There are notebooks on the desk. There are a chair under the table. A chair is singular. You say there is. There is a chair under the table. Grammar Tips We will look at tips for there isn't, there aren't. We put the word not after be verbs to make the sentence negative. Examples Let's look at some examples. There is not a boy in the school. You can see not is after the be verb is. There isn't a strawberry in the basket. Isn't is short for is not. There are not any bears in the country. There aren't any books on the shelf. Aren't is short for are not. Grammar Tips Now we will look at tips for making a question. Is there? Are there? The be verbs come before there to make a question. Examples Let's look at some examples. Is there a market? Is is the be verb and it's before there. It makes a question. Is there a dog in the house? Are there leaves? Are there gloves in the store? Right and wrong. Now for the right and wrong section. Is there pigs? This is wrong because pigs is plural. We use the be verb are with plural. Are there pigs? Are there a school in the town? This is wrong because a school is singular. We use is with singular. 
Is there a school in the town? Quiz. Circle the right word. There is are a candy in the basket. A candy is singular. So you circle is. There is a candy in the basket. There is are five people in the store. Five people is plural. You use are with plural. There are five people in the store. Is are there books in the bag? Books is plural. You circle are. Are there books in the bag? There isn't, are not, a glass on the table. A glass is singular. You choose isn't. There isn't a glass on the table. Quiz. We will look at the map and answer the questions. Is there a hospital on the map? The answer is yes, there is. Is there a supermarket on the map? The answer is no, there isn't. There is no supermarket on the map. Are there cars on the map? The answer is yes, there are. Are there dogs on the map? The answer is no, there aren't. Is there a school on the map? The answer is yes, there is. We will write a question. The answer is, yes, there are frogs in the pond. We start the question with a B verb, are. Are there frogs in the pond? The answer is, yes. There is a washroom in the building. Start the question with the be verb, is. Is there a washroom in the building? In the next section, we find the mistake and correct it. There is four ducks on the lake. There are four ducks, so we do not choose is. We need the plural be verb. The answer is 
There are four ducks on the lake. Are there a kangaroo? A kangaroo is singular. So we use is. Is there a kangaroo? There not are any apples in the basket. Be verbs come before the word not. The answer is, there are not any apples in the basket. Is there tapes? Tapes is plural. We have to use a plural be verb. The answer should be, are there tapes? Let's make a sentence using the words below. The first letter should be a capital. This, Emily's, bedroom, is. This is Emily's bedroom. Next, there is, on the desk, a computer. There is a computer on the desk. Books on the bookshelf there are. There are books on the bookshelf. Look at the next one. A vase there is on the desk. There is a vase on the desk. Is there in the vase a flower? Is there a flower in the vase? Yes, is there. Yes, there is.